Every year, Honor Flight of Central Oregon pays respect to those who serve by taking them to the nation's capital. The COVID-19 pandemic has now made that reality nearly impossible. Alec Nolan is here with more. Alec? Lee, on a day where we honor veterans, it's hard to believe some of these men have never visited the very monument honoring the war they served in. Now, because of the pandemic, time is running out for those keeping that dream alive. It's an emotional roller coaster. That's the experience Dane Prevat goes through when he visits the nation's capital. But he's not alone. For the past five years, he's been alongside veterans of Central Oregon through the Honor Flight Network. Honor Flight is a nonprofit organization created to honor America's veterans. The organization transports veterans to Washington, D.C. to visit and reflect on their historic monuments. It's life changing. Once you do it, you'll never not do it again. As president of Honor Flight Central Oregon, Prevat has been dealt a difficult hand. Just like everyone else, Honor Flight is enduring the complications of the COVID-19 pandemic. All flights got canceled. We pushed the May trip of 2020 back to October, then we pushed the October trip to May 2021. Time is running out, and Prevat wants to keep this dream alive for the veterans that deserve it. We have one veteran that's coming. Um, he just turned 100 this year, and he was a B-29 pilot in World War II and in Korea. And we're just praying that he's able to go. Prevat says what makes matters even worse is that many of these veterans fall in the at-risk bracket for the virus. He says they expect apprehension, but they've never taken anyone who wasn't completely moved by the experience. For many, it's a time of self-healing, a time to reflect. Honor Flight is still accepting veteran applications. Their next trip is scheduled for May 5th, 2021. Lee, back to you.